Hey, it's Rick here, and I've got an iPhone 5 case to show you today. This one is by Sketch, and it's called the Grip Shock. It comes in the packaging that you see right here. Inside of that packaging, you are going to receive a couple of extras here. So you will get a screen shield as well as a microfiber wipe and a squeegee to apply that screen shield. In the case itself, it is a TPU case, so it is going to give some great protection against impact, uh, shocks, some moderate level of drop protection, and as you saw, it is very flexible, but it's going to retain its shape because of that TPU material. Now, my iPhone does not have a screen protector on it right now. It does have a back protector, as you can see here, uh, but I suspect that this case isn't going to be too troublesome with a screen protector or a back protector for that matter. You can see how it fits with my back protector that I've got here. And a screen protector shouldn't be too much of an issue because this sits right around the edges and doesn't really overlap on your screen. Now let's go ahead and take a look at this up close. Let's start with the back here. This almost looks like a basket weave design and this particular color is more of a purple. There are some other colors in this case that are available. Uh, you've got some sketch branding right there in the corner and it gives a nice textured feel in the hand because of that basket weave. There's a big cutout there for your camera and it does not exhibit any issues with whiteout or washout in your photos when you're taking them and that LED flash is going off, so no problems there. Along the side here, you can see your cutout for your silent switch. Your buttons are covered up here and those buttons raise up just a little bit so you can actually feel them when you rub your finger over the side of the case. Down below, that's what it's gonna look like from your port perspective and everything is cut out. It's a little bit narrow here for your headphone jack so while I haven't run into too many problems with headphones on this if you've got an oversized uh, jack for maybe DJ equipment you might run into some issues there but otherwise everything is looking good here. Along the side it is completely enclosed and then up along the top you can see your sleep awake button is also covered as well. Looking at the face of the phone you can see that there is a little bit of a lay on the table design here and that means that this comes up and above the screen so that if we put this face down on a table, the case is gonna be touching, not the screen. These buttons are pretty responsive when you press them. It requires a little bit of additional uh, press of the buttons when you're gonna press this, uh, but it's nothing too bad. I do like that the volume buttons have a clicky feel to them, so when you press them, you are gonna get a tactile response. You do feel a little bit of clickiness here. Your sleep awake button, not so much. It feels pretty solid. It requires a little bit more effort than those volume buttons do, but overall, not a bad case. Again, this case is going to provide a decent level of uh, drop protection because of the material it's made out of, but it also keeps your iPhone 5 very slim and very lightweight, so it is a nice alternative to some of the more bulky cases out there. Overall, I am going to give the Sketch Grip Shock a 4 out of 5. I like what it does. I like the color. It's a pretty minimalistic case, but adds a little bit of a design element to it with that basket weave. Comes with the screen protector as well. Well, kind of wish that that top button was a little bit more tactile in its response, but overall the Sketch Grip Shock for the iPhone 5 gets my 4 out of 5. If you guys have questions, comments, or feedback, as always, please feel free to let me know down below. Otherwise, I'll talk to you next time. Take care, everybody, and have fun.